Hey Internet, this is Big Al over here at Paler. Let's take a look on on uh, at AutoCAD and points on a Cartesian plane, how we locate them, how we define them, so on and so forth. Um, we're going to put a point on here someplace. Uh, I don't know where, but let's put a point on this screen someplace. How do we do that? Swing up to your Draw menu, click, pick up point. Notice when you picked up point, Okay, because I have dynamics turned on, you can read the location of my crosshair in X and Y. Okay, the navy blue, if you will, uh, is the X location or the X value, and the box to the right of it, the window to the right of it, tells you the Y value. Okay, so if you come way down here someplace, you should be able to lock up on zero, zero if you hunt all around for it. But, anyways, let's put a point up here someplace. Now I can either click it or I can enter it. Okay, so let me enter a point. Let's say five, comma eight. Enter. So five in the x direction, eight in the y direction. Hmm, where would that be? Well, I don't know. It's got to be up here someplace. Ooh, there it is. Okay. See five eight. See as I get closer. Now I'm only using the node command here just as sort of a helper here to get you to recognize that this point is indeed located at 5 on the x-axis and 8 or the coordinate pair is 5, 8. Okay, um, let me see. The other thing about points you know is a straight line is the shortest distance between two points, right? Uh, points, being able to identify points uh, in any number of ways in AutoCAD is important for you to continue the AutoCAD building process. So that should take care of points. Um, let me just summarize. Let, let me let me turn dynamics off just to show you. The dynamics is off. Okay. See, I can still see that that location, but I cannot read directly what that location is. Now, yes, I can if I look down here on the coordinate area but uh, on the status line, but basically real-time live I can't see it. And so by leaving dynamics on I can see wherever I am. Okay? Alright, so this is Big Al at Paler and we'll talk again.